Yeah, and then like last year we had the army worm take it from here to here in five days. Yeah. Unreal. That was crazy. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think we got the army worm. You're lucky. Cool. I think I think it just must have oh, flew right over you. Yeah. That here. was the most destructive little bug I think I've ever seen in my life. Yeah. It was amazing. It cleared this whole field off in a week. Be yeah. gone. Down yeah. to nothing. Down to no grazing. Yeah. Down. Yeah. Actually, they were out here. We, we ended up. This one? I think we did spray yeah. this one. Yeah. It was funny. The uh, the headed out. Uh, what was headed out again? Was the ryegrass. The ryegrass. There was some headed out ryegrass, and and uh, they didn't really like the the stem. So it basically be just a uh, you know whatever there's a ryegrass kind of. It was just basically a, a stick point. Little up. stick pointed up. Yeah, with, with no leaves on it, no head on it, nothing. Just, just a, little just sticks. A stick. Yeah, but they, yeah. Even canary grass, it did that to it. It was crazy. Yeah. It's unreal. Yeah, this ground was just crawling. Yeah. Okay, we did spray this one. Yeah, we did. But yeah. once we got them killed, actually, the grass came back pretty good. Mm -hmm. Now, do you have crane flies? Your yeah. crane flies are they? We had a field. Speaking of crane flies, here's a good story for you. So we had crane flies. We didn't know we had crane flies. So customer took off first cutting. We went in to drill it with 300. We wanted to overseed it, get a couple more years out of it, right? Mm -hmm. So we go rolling in there, and customer calls me instantly. I was on my way out to the farm. Guys there drilling. He's like, there's something wrong. Does your guy know how to run this thing? And I says, yeah, he's been running it a long time, right? Why? I was like, I'll, I'll be right there. And it had actually pulled up that whole pass. It looked like a sod cutter had almost gone through and took all that sod. And it was plugging up this machine, kind of probably similar to what happened here with, okay. the, so with the soft dirt, uh -huh. with a little bit of sod, whatever, right? Makes these chunks and builds up. And I go roll out there. I'm like, what's going on, right? and the operator's just digging the stuff out of the machine and it's just crawling with crane fly larva. So we get the gas can out, we go do some spots, you know, the test, and we're getting about 45 per square foot. I think, what do they say, 12 you should spray? Um, I'm I don't even remember, remember but yeah, 12 but to 20-ish, I think, is right in there, and we're at 45 average. It was, I was blown away. We hadn't seen that for a long time, but that was, a, I mean, otherwise we wouldn't have even known there was they were out there, right? Mm -hmm. So, until it would have been and, too late. And we sprayed it, and that field came right back. It's beautiful. Like the grass just got way healthier. Uh, we just overseeded it on Monday this week, Tuesday, a few days ago. We overseeded it. So, yeah, it'll be interesting. Yeah. Yeah.